Gemini, welcome to Karina Star Tarot. This is a timeless general reading for the whole of the Gemini Collective. So take what resonates for you and leave what doesn't. If this reading doesn't resonate for you, then check out your Moon, Venus and Rising signs in some of my other readings. Also, if you're interested in purchasing a private reading from me, then you can find the link to private readings in the description box directly below this video. And as usual, please don't forget to hit the like button, share this video and subscribe to my channel. So I'm going to jump straight into your reading Gemini, see what comes out for you. And I'm using the Lightseer's Tarot deck. And the first card out for you is the Eight of Wands. There was one other sign that had the first card out as this. And I can't remember what, it, what sign that was for you. Another card out for you is the Ace of Wands fire energy so you've got a lot of fiery Aries Leo Sagittarius come out for you got dealing with fire sign and got the ace of pentacles earth energy Capricorn Taurus Virgo so yeah this communication this is an indication here of the eight of wands of communication coming in good news I think um, for some of you this could be from someone that you could be in a relationship with that currently separated from um, it could be someone calling you and apologising there could have been an argument and you could have separated temporarily um, and you may feel that this person's never going to come around, never apologise, never hold, be accountable. But I feel that they are going to come back with an apology here. They feel very passionate for you. They don't want to lose you. I feel that they are going to contact you. This could also be in regards to a job for some of you. Um, especially if you're in the creative industry. Um, I see good news coming in regarding... Um, contract that you may of that you might that you may win you know that you may have gained a contract uh, to do a job or perhaps you've been given a promotion or are going to be given a promotion here um, I feel that some of you could have a lot of options in love um, a lot of you have definitely been working really hard um, on yourself, um, working hard within a relationship. Someone wants to work hard on restoring this relationship here, I feel. Someone wants to work on these problems. Someone's coming in and apologising. Someone wants to work through these problems with you. So I feel there's been some sort of fallout here with someone. If it's not a relationship, it could be with a friend, but someone wants to work on resolving your problems, your issues. Um, someone definitely wants to return to your life. Someone that you may have temporarily fallen out with or split up with here. They're coming in with an apology for sure. Let's continue on. I've got the Five of Pentacles. So you definitely... I've been feeling, or someone's feeling left out in the cold, yeah. Got the judgment card here. Yeah. Someone's definitely feeling left out in the cold by perhaps you. You could feel the same. Someone's really missing you, feeling really lonely and lost without you here. Very much in their emotions. Um, beginning to... I mean, some some of someone who you're dealing with uh, perhaps feels that there's no hope, or very, or the chances are that they have with you are very slim. You know, like they're losing hope in this situation, but they're going to try anyway because they definitely want a second chance with you. They want this. They want to get back together. They want you to resolve this this agreement, this dispute, this argument, whatever it is that you've fallen out over, they want another chance, they want to put things right, they're coming in with an apology, like I said, 
um, there's a decision here for you or the other person to make in regards to whether you want to get back with this person. Um, like I said, it does seem like a like a, a temporary separation for some of you. Um, there are going to be emotions expressed. This person has a lot of emotions, maybe very strongly in their emotions. But, uh, they feel a lot of love for you still. They they are missing you, and they 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 do have a lot of love. Um, they may not uh, be the best at expressing those emotions, but they're certainly thinking that they should start being more expressive in regards to the work their feelings. Um, this person has an, an awful lot of love inside for you. Um, I just feel that they're really missing you, you know, and, and absence definitely makes the heart grow fonder for sure. You could be dealing with a Scorpio because the Judgment card is Scorpio energy. So I've got the Five of Cups. So yeah, this person's definitely in their emotions. They're really missing you. They are so regretful. They have so many regrets. So many cards out here that show how strong the strength of their regret is. Is is undeniable here. With the five of cups very much in their emotions of course you could be also strong in your emotions missing them as well you or they could have been in hermit mode I feel they're coming out of that if they were but you're definitely in hermit mode um i feel that they've done a lot of reflecting and um that's why they're coming forward with an apology um they're taking accountability for their actions they very much regret Whatever was said in the heat of the moment or done, they're full of regret here and they would like to come back for sure. They, there may be silence as well between both of you. you. But like I said, they're about to break the silence. So I really feel that. You may not be ready to break this silence. You may, you may continue to distance yourself from this person. You may not be ready. Yeah, you may not. You are, you may feel very conflicted, um, unsure about what to do, undecided, um, really conflicted. I feel. Um, let's continue on. Let's get some outcome for this. Yeah, there's a lot of conflict. You could also be dealing with uh, a Virgo with the Hermit. So the strongest signs that have come out for you in this reading are Virgo and Scorpio of course you've got a lot of cups wands and swords and pentacles so you know it could be any sign but the strongest energies are the major arcana cards which is a Virgo and with the judgment card a Scorpio so let's see the two cards wanted to jump out here so two good very positive cards here We've got the Ten of Pentacles here and the World card. Really positive. This outcome could work out really well, actually, because this Ten of Pentacles is about the security, happiness, having a future, having a fresh start, being happy. Um, so for a lot of you, if you can overcome these problems and work through them and you know, I feel that it could be very successful. You know, you could be very happy together because it does indicate a really good outcome here. And with the world card, this is a chance for a new beginning, a new start to have that balance, harmony and happiness in your life. Uh, this is a whole fresh new start. You know, I kind of feel that for those of you that do decide to give this person a chance, it could really work out favourably that you are going to overcome these problems um and i think things are going to move forward in a positive way for both of you there's definitely a chance here for a really good positive fresh start here you know um without a doubt The lovers, Gemini, could be dealing with a Gemini as well. Your own star sign. 
of course it could be just your energy coming out in this reading this is all about making a choice making a decision in regards to love so you have an important decision to make in regards to love whether you think this can work or not remember the outcome is looking really good here could be a good decision for you as well I can see you being very happy together there is a lot of passion and fire that exists between you you both have very strong feelings for each other and a lot of desire for each other as well yeah page of wands this is all looking really good so yeah there's definitely a chance here for a positive new beginning and you know a fresh start chance to start again got two splits here and what came out was the chariot and the hierophant so yeah definitely a chance to move forward in a positive way uh, it could be dealing with a cancer as well you know um so this is this really could be a really you know fresh start you know starting again with this person and you know I see a very positive outcome here and there could be a higher level of commitment that's involved especially with the ten of pentacles and the world coming out here and you've got the hierophant you could be dealing with taurus as well so a higher level of commitment this could all lead to a marriage engagement you know moving in together buying a house together you know living together making a bold statement um uh, that you're committed to each other committed on working out the problems within your relationship and working towards you know that security and that good future together building together so yeah i do see a, a good positive outcome here let's get you some romance angels now you got it's safe for you to love so if you're having um, an indecision feeling un undecided the romance angels are saying it's safe for you to love so open your heart out to this because this person's going to make you happy if you can overcome your problems this person will make you happy got a calling in your soulmate so it could be that you are soulmates and divinely guided to be together give your relationship a chance you've also got passion there's a lot of passion between both of you and attraction as well see there's still a lot of strong strong feelings that are definitely present between both of you um, and let's give you a bit of a time scale about when you got within the next few weeks. So this could all be happening for you in the next few weeks. You could get that communication from this person within the next few weeks. Uh, you've also got, if you want, if you're unsure and undecided, you've got ask your angels. So ask for guidance if you feel that you need to. And we've also got peaceful resolution so there is going to be a peaceful resolution to this whole situation it's going to be a peaceful outcome also I should point out the ten of pentacles um means that there could be abundance coming in for you as well uh money um you could find yourself getting a promotion there's definitely money coming in for you with the ten of pentacles um, I say that because you've also got another card here that backs up. You've got abundance. So your money is going to really look, really improve. If it's if you're having problems with your money now, it's all going to look really a lot better within the next few weeks. So that was your reading, Gemini. Um, please don't forget to hit the like button, share this video and subscribe to my channel. Take care and I'll see you all soon. Bye.